Four Republican U.S. congressmen from Michigan and 15 Republican state lawmakers are now supporting a lawsuit to overturn the state's election results. The four congressmen signed a brief in support of Texas's suit at the Supreme Court level. The same four also won re-election in the November election. The suit was filed earlier this week by the Texas Attorney General asking the Supreme Court to overturn the results, not just in Michigan, but also in Pennsylvania, Georgia and Wisconsin as well. Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel issued a written response to the suit in court, calling it unprecedented and without factual foundation. New here at noon, a Detroit father has been arrested after police say that he accidentally shot his son. This happened Thursday night at a home on Meringue right near Kaju. Detroit police are telling us that the father was trying to take bullets out of his handgun when it went off, hitting that nine year old. The father then took the boy to the hospital where he's listed in temporary serious condition. Police are telling us that this is still being investigated. And a 22 year old man accused of killing a little girl on Detroit's east side has been denied bond. Christian Mitchell Childress, who's pictured here, faces first degree premeditated murder charges in the death of seven year old Regine Williams. Police say he was in a car that shot through a home on Detroit's east side. This was back in October. Someone inside that car shot into the home and sadly the child was killed by that shooting after a bullet hit her while she was simply sitting on the couch in the home. Another man has also been charged. Mitchell Childress is due back in court next week.